this mission, the Irvine 01 uh, launch on uh, its business time is special. Um, one, for Rocket Lab, because it's our first commercial launch, so we're really excited to have payloads like Irvine 01 on board. Um, and then for the students themselves, um, as they built this satellite and will be operating this satellite, so it's, it's really special for them to be, able, to be able to do that with a rocket that's been assembled, at least starting with the engines and the avionics, just down the road in Huntington Beach compared to where they are in Irvine, so just down the 405. So Irvine 01 is a 10 by 10 by 10 centimeter one unit CubeSat and it has solar panels on the sides, it has an aluminum alloy frame, the, the main payload is the 3 megapixel camera and we will be using it to capture images of stars and planets and to basically just find out the distance from our CubeSat to stars. Irvine 01 took about two years to work on and to like finish up everything. Um, in terms of how it feels now, it's pretty satisfying. We're so thankful and relieved to have found Electron to launch with us and like, give us a ride to space. To be a part of history and to be their first commercial launch, it feels amazing to be part of this technology revolution. This STEM program, the uh, launch of the Irvine 01 spacecraft uh, on the Electron, is so important. It's just really the involvement of students, particularly high school students, on a spacecraft. It's an opportunity that typically wouldn't exist until these students would be in college or in the workforce. I'm excited for the future of the CubeSat program for Irvine 01, 2, 3, 4, 5. I mean, there is so much, you know, opportunity and room for exploration, innovation, creation. And so I'm excited and I'm looking forward to what the future holds.